Welcome to Co Cosex 3 Stream, Color Fits, Cosex 3 Stream. It's going with uh, zero piece time, 1K resources, and I think we're um, not going with the DC or market in this option mode. A little bit of lobby fun. As uh, somebody was suggesting that uh, UK was not the best uh, nation to take in this mode, but uh, looks like uh, Ahmed uh, went ahead and uh, took it anyway. So we'll see how he fares. Yeah, he, he took Ukraine. He's off into a uh, fast and furious start collecting resources. Looks like color fits going with um, town center, mill, blacksmith, and uh, his first uh, 17th century barracks. So over there, uh, brought all those peasants over to uh, collect uh, collect some uh, wheat from the mill. Barracks is complete. Oh boy, who built the Algerian barracks right next to Colafit's base? And here they come! Here comes Algeria. Oh my god, I'm gonna have a stroke. Algeria just moved into Color Fit's base. Holy cow, I never seen that move before. So we're picking up, oh, the sun, I see this blue collar building a, a barracks right in color fits base. This is the most unusual thing I've ever seen.
Yeah, I don't know about color. Yeah, I don't know. It's like they're trying the same type of strategy where they're uh, trying to flank them again. And uh, color fits going into the base and trying to draw the army out and keep them occupied while uh, blue goes around the side. Go. They got one of his coal mines. Did a little better but job protecting uh, with his light infantry, protecting his uh, archers. For some reason, the Sir Dukes aren't firing, so I don't know what happened. He must have run out of coal or forgot to make it because uh, another Ahmed's uh, Sir Dukes aren't firing. He doesn't have any coal mines, does he? Yes, and there he goes. A little gamemanship being played there that the guy said uh, he told you it was a bad choice. I seen it work. I just uh, could have just been the people attacking. Because, you know, yes, Ahmad's down. You need to have uh, most of my games, people end up telling me to send resources. Unfortunately, you can send resources, but you have to wait the 15 minutes. And right now we're about at the 10 minute mark, so you got about five more minutes to uh, wait. Hmm. So you'll quit, but uh, looks like Almond's still alive. I'm odd. I just doesn't have any coal. There we go, he's gonna go uh go build his cold mines. Still has a pretty good number of Sir Dukes there if they could get shooting. He rebuilt his town center. He has uh three Cossacks houses. Right now he has one gold mine, one iron mine, and one coal mine. So like he's making some sort of formations. And hiding them in the trees. I don't know. It looked like the guy who was Algeria decided to quit. I don't know what happened to him. I missed why he quit. Did he think the game was over? Put all his men in bases. Everything was gone. I'm not sure what happened to him. Yeah, he should have chose Rui again. Really would have stayed. Rui couldn't make it to the end of peacetime, but he would have stayed. Looks like we got the three on three that we always wanted. Looks like Mark's in deep trouble up in the upper right hand corner. As Beppa and uh, Pirate both attacking him. Down to his last few uh, pikemen. Yeah. Wasn't looking good. Looks like Mark called it a day. Now we're down to Star and. Ahmed on the top team 
And we have Color Fit and Pirate on the lower team. Now we're down to two versus two. Amin probably got his uh, Sir Duke's uh, firing, but uh, unfortunately it was a little too much uh, to overcome Color Fit's army. Yeah, it looks like uh, Color Fit called it a day before Rui could get a chance to play. But that's the way Cossacks 3 bounces. And we'll catch you later for another edition of Color Fit's Cossacks 3.